Hey everybody, Eric here from the MMG. I am doing a how-to on getting icons back for video files. I don't know what happened on my end, but for some reason now when I record a video, they show up as the VLC uh, warning cone right here instead of what I used to have, which was a preview or a thumbnail of the video like this right here, which is very helpful when you're editing so you can find the videos that you want to uh, edit a lot quicker than ones with icons that just have these, you know, the dates. So I uh, followed a couple steps. A lot of people said to go into your, your system properties. I'm going to show you that real quick. And to do this, you just need to type in uh, view advanced, view advanced system properties and it should pop up. It's, it's also in your control panel if you're having problems finding it. And then go to system properties and you know, pop up this little box right here. And you need to go to performance right here and go to settings. And then a lot of people said if this is unchecked, show thumbnails instead of icons. So if I uncheck that and hit apply, you're going to see even the videos that showed them before now are just the icons. So um, so what I thought would be is I just recheck this and it would fix the issue, but it doesn't. So you can see there's still the cones. So first thing I would have you guys do if you run into this issue is check to make sure that that little box right here is checked to show thumbnails instead of icons. Hit OK. Now, if you're still having the issue like I am, I found the way to fix it. So, um, and this may be very specific to the VLC. I'm not sure the VLC player, but I know it's very common. So more than likely, I'm going to assume most of you are having the same issue that I'm having. But there is a codec pack that is called the K-Lite codec pack that you need to actually download. You can go to their website here, codecguide.com. We'll take you there, and then you'll find a link to download right here. And then you just download the one that you want. Uh, I went ahead and just did the download full right here. I, I assume any of them will actually fix the issue, but I, I only tried the full one myself. And uh, once you do that, you just need to uh, run it or install it. And it'll pop up a box like this. And then you just need to hit next. We're going to install normal. Everything right here is fine. Yep, looks good. Hit next. Hit next. Next. Yep. And this is all just pretty... I mean, pretty much most, most of you guys are just going to want to cruise through this. So you might read the settings very carefully. Um, there might be something in there you don't want changed. So, you know, read them, look at them, and make sure. But for most people, I think you're fine with the default settings there just to cruise through it. All right, now it's done. Now we're just going to hit finish. And if we look at our icons now, you will see it now fixed the issue. See how they're back to where they were. They're not the icons anymore. And these are the same as they were, you know. So I don't know what happened. I don't know why that broke for me. I'm not sure exactly what happened, but I tried a ton of stuff and I couldn't figure it out, um, but that was the fix. So hopefully this video helped you. Please give a subscribe if it did. Your support really keeps us going and making these videos. Thanks for watching and have yourself a great day.